Hello, my name is Dr. Michael Mack. I'm one of the residents here at the University of Calgary here to explain to you Cataract C Chopping, Cracking and Chopping Training Level 5. In this particular level, your job is to move the opposing spheres uh, together. Now, you have to be very slow and methodical, just like the Cataract B level. Make sure that your instrument tips are buried deep inside the sphere. You want to attend, uh, put all your attention and the focus of your eyes to making sure that uh, both of the instrument tips do not leave the sphere because that's the easiest way to uh, fail the level or to cause you to not get a hundred so there you can tell that I accidentally let it slip and so I've lost points for that let's take a look at that one more time so here I'm making sure that my instruments are buried and I'm able to bring them together. I like putting the bottom um, sphere to my left instrument and the top sphere to my right instrument, but I am right hand dominant, so maybe people who are left handed might have a little bit of an easier time. So just slowly bringing them together. And there we go. Let's take a look at that one final time. put the instruments deep inside the sphere, bring them slowly together, making sure that you're burying your tip deeper as you uh, progress um, closer and closer to the center. And then here I'm actually being very careful because I know that my right hand is slipping a little bit outside the sphere. So I take some precautions to try to bury it a bit deeper. And so that was a perfect level. So the last attempt was actually 100. The other first two attempts were 99 each. So thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe for more videos.